Okay, now today I just wanted to talk about something really dumb that I was honestly kind of uh, pissed off about for a little bit. Now, I know I haven't made one of these nest like rant videos in quite a while now, and I decided to at least start it up again and maybe make more in the future. So what I'm going to be talking about today are Sans fangirls, and if you don't know who those people are, well, they're people that A, want to fuck Sans, and two and B, make one minute long animations and make a bank off of it. They get like hundreds of thousands of subscribers and don't even work super hard for it. Now the reason why this kind of pisses me off is because they just overshadow shit. Now I know this happens like all the fucking time on YouTube because... Because... People that are like douche tubers make really shitty videos and... Like, like and subscribe, comment down below to enter my gift card giveaway, like, uh, those kinds of people, like, take away from qual people that make quality comment, that make quality commentary videos, and I'm sorry if I'm kind of stuttering, but, uh, this is, this is the same shit that happens with Sans fangirls. Now, honestly, when it comes to animation, and when it comes to anything, really, taste is almost always super subjective. Like, I have this friend at, uh, school, and he really hates my, uh, this album on my phone that contains a lot of hardened shipping hentai, and that's completely fine, right? And if you, uh, don't like my hardened Archie and Maxi giving each other the bone, then that's completely fine, alright? But the reason why I'm kind of mad about subjectivity here is because there are people that make one minute long animation memes in get so many subscribers off of this, and I'm not really jealous at all, I'm just baffled. But I guess being baffled to death is better than being jealous to death, because these people make animations that are just like, oh, this character's super innocent, and then cut to them being edgy, and though they're innocent again, and then cut back to them being edgy. And that's all they fucking do, along with a couple of, like, 12-second shitpost animations, and then they, uh, make bank off of it. And then when people that put months of time and effort into their animations and they get barely anything out of it and not a thousand subscribers if they're fucking lucky, alright? Because I voice act for a few of these series myself and one of them came out about a month, a month and a half ago and I thought it was pretty good even though I played kind of a minor role in it. But here's the thing about it is that it took about a month which is pretty quick, usually, for things like this, and I was pretty impressed. And I also voice acted for something else that came out a few years ago that was really impressive, in my opinion. And it took forever to make, but... I also voiced a pretty minor role in that, too, but... It's kind of sad that people that make animations like this are getting a lot less attention than they really deserve. And I just wanted to get this out there, because I'm saying... All I want to say is Sans fangirls are kind of overrated, and they kind of suck. Well, I'm not saying the animations they make themselves are bad. They're actually really smooth most of the time. But I'm just saying, like, these people don't like going out of their comfort zone, and they don't like making things that aren't animation memes and shitpost animations. Like, they won't give a hand at something that takes less than a week. Which is kind of sad, because people that make take months on this are very unpopular and very underrated, and I just wanted to say that, again, taste in animation is very subjective. If you like a Sans fangirl, cool, but it just kind of upsets me, and it's kind of an insulting to me that people uh, are giving these people so much attention, and then the fact that people that spend months on their stuff get barely any attention on what they really deserve, and that's really all I gotta say. TLDR, if you like Sans fangirls, it's cool, but the thing is, they're very overrated, and they should at least step out of their comfort zone for a little bit and try something else other than edgy animation memes. Peace.